Short Short Gamey Story Time It was a bright and sunny morning. Baby Taku was playing in the garden. Suddenly, baby Taku's mother heard him grow very excited. <laughs> baby Taku's mother came to see what had happened. What happened, dear? Baby Taku showed his mother a fluffy little chick that had come into the garden. There's a little chick in our garden. It must have wandered away from the farm. I think it's looking for its mama. <coughs> yes, dear. Just like you have me as your mama, this little chick has a mama too. She's the hen who lays eggs and lives on the farm. Yes, yes, dear. We'll help this chick find its mother. Oh, yeah. Baby Taku's mother then put the chick in a basket. <laughs> mother and baby Taku then took the chick and went looking for the chick's mother. As soon as they reached the farm, they saw the chick's mother. She was a plump brown hen. And she was clucking and asking her friends on the farm if they had seen her chick. the chick's mother, dear. She looks very worried. She must be looking for the chick. Come on, let's tell her that the chick is here. Baby Taku and his mother then called out to the hen. Mama hen? Are you looking for your chick? Don't worry, your chick is here. The hen was very happy. She immediately ran towards the chick. <laughs> Baby Taku and his mother then put the basket down and let the chick out. The little chick and the hen were very happy to see each other. And baby Taku was so happy to see them together that he clapped his hands, jumped with joy, and laughed happily. <laughs> baby Taku then gave his mother a hug and lots and lots of kisses. He was happy that his mother had been kind and helped the little chick find its mother. One day, while playing at school, Cha-Cha fell down and hurt himself. Ow! Because he got hurt, 
Cha-Cha had to sit out while his friends played some of his favorite games. That made him feel very upset. Cha-Cha still felt sad when it was time to go home. And he sat by himself very quietly. Choo-Choo, Chica, and Chiku tried to cheer up Cha-Cha. Why don't you come play with us, Cha-Cha? Hmm, we're going to play a new game. It won't be any fun without you. Cha-Cha's mother encouraged him to go and play with the other children. Cha-Cha, why don't you join Choo-Choo, Chica, and Chiku? You'll have fun. And you'll forget all about what happened today. But Cha-Cha was still upset. No, thank you. I don't want to play with anyone today. Just then, the baby woke up. and started crawling all over the house. The baby saw Cha-Cha and noticed that he looked very upset. The baby took some of his favorite toys and gave them to Cha-Cha. He wanted Cha-Cha to play with them and feel happy. But Cha-Cha didn't want the baby's toys. Uh, no! The baby tried to pull Cha-Cha so Cha-Cha would get up and play. <laughs> but Cha-Cha refused to get up. No! The baby then looked at Cha-Cha very lovingly and smiled. The baby's innocent smile made Cha-Cha smile too. And Cha-Cha finally stopped being upset and stood up. Baby, you are so sweet. You cheered me up with your love and your smile. I love you. To Cha-Cha's great surprise, the baby kissed him. Cha-Cha felt so happy that he laughed. <laughs> Thank you, baby. Cha-Cha then went to join Chuchu, Chica, and Chiku in their games. Wait for me, everybody. I'm coming to play. Hooray! Everyone was happy to see Cha-Cha smiling again. They were so surprised that the baby who was so little had managed to cheer Cha-Cha up with his love. <laughs>